Hi everyone, welcome back. So as you see, we are in a totally different setting. We are not in my beauty room, we are actually at my hair salon. So as most of you guys know, I own a hair salon um, in Massachusetts. I am a hairdresser and a makeup artist. Um, so I decided today to do something a little different for this video and bring on you guys into my salon. So we are doing today a taping extension, kind of not really a how-to, but just to show you what it's like, what the service is like getting. Um, and yeah, so this client took her extensions out prior to the quarantine um, and now she went dark and we are going to color her extensions and re-put them back in her hair. Um, so any questions you guys may have, please comment down below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Do not forget to subscribe because I do have really amazing content coming to this video. Uh, not this video, sorry, this YouTube channel. Um, and yeah, so don't forget to follow the beauty and let's get into the video. So first we are gonna color these extensions and we are going to match them up perfect to her hair. While these are processing, I am going to cut into her hair um, and give it a nice fresh trim so that way it grows out nicely while the extensions are in her head. All right, now that her hair is nice and dry, we are gonna go in with nice clean sections on the hair. I am really precise with my sectioning. I want everything to be very clean, straight, and even when applying the extensions. If you kind of get messy with your sectioning, you'll see that the tape on the extensions might get attached to another part of the hair and it will get all tangled and hurt really bad if you're trying to get that hair out that's stuck. So now that my sectioning is all set, as you see, I take a very thin piece of hair where you can see right through it, and I will take one part of the extension and I will put it underneath and tape the hair like almost a sandwich. When the extension is in, I like to comb through it, give it a little pull too, and add the next one. All right, and once I start making my way up to the top, I grab my flat iron and I start flat ironing her natural hair and the extensions. Remember, this is human hair extensions. That's why I can take heat to it and I can color them and they are still healthy and look great. Silky and soft.
As I make my way up to the top, I grab smaller pieces of extensions to blend into the hair. Now time for styling. And voila, it's all done.